What's new in Fluid 1.2 official ROM based on Android 11 running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in Fluid 1.2 official ROM based on Android 11 running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro. In case you want to have a look at the features of previous builds, know how to install this ROM, videos for all of those can be found in the description of this video. The first change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to February 2021. The kernel they are using is Fluid Extended. Build date is from February 5th and of course it now shows the correct ram which is 6 gb the cpu is snapdragon 855 battery is 4000 milli amp hours on this device the first change you will notice is that if you go into settings and then you go into fluid customization tap on the third option which is for quick settings bam here it is traffic indicators in the building and you can choose between three different options disabled status bar or quick status bar you have a toggle for auto hide then you have the options for display mode three different options upload and download upload only and download only then if you enable the auto hide option then the option below that which is your slider for the inactivity threshold gets enabled and you can also change the refresh interval as well and what is your traffic measurement unit you want it in bits per second or do you want it in bytes per second and in case you want to hide the arrows you have a toggle for that as well other than that they have also bumped up the call volume for the redmi k20 pro and the rom change log might mention something about a new build ending but that is for developers who build this rom from source no ui changes can be seen with respect to that for the end user next up in terms of youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine there are no jitters no lags live caption works picture in picture mode works of course for picture in picture mode to work either you need youtube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to purchase youtube premium next up let us check for ok google so as you can see ok google is working now i'm not sure why the ui here is on the top i did see this issue in some other rom as well but they fixed it in the next build but i'm not sure what's happening here let us try with the screen off so hey google are you awake mic testing hey google hey google all right peeps so hey google is still broken on this build with the screen turned off but when the screen is turned on then hey google works without any issues as you can see on your screen one more time next up in terms of security unfortunately you do not have screen off fod on this rom but yes the fod on this rom is pretty good then you do have face unlock and next up let us also check for widewine so here it is drm info application security level is mentioned as l1 and let me open the prime video application let us continue watching this movie and as you can see you do not have the hd text at the bottom near the timeline which means l1 is broken now of course you should know that you have to blame xiaomi or redmi for this there's nothing wrong with the rom itself next up let us open the google photos application and let me try to edit this picture three bar menu on the bottom wait for this loading option to finish I'm going to adjust portrait light bam here it is portrait light is there and it works without any issues next up let me open the magisk manager application and let me check for safety net let us try it one more time there it is safety net is passing without any issues my device is not rooted i have only installed magisk manager to check for safety net we can also open the play store application and go into settings as you can see device is certified which means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues 
Next up, let us check if they have the pixel exclusive wallpapers with this ROM or not because they did drop some culture wallpapers pretty recently. So let us go into settings. We'll go into display, styles and wallpapers. Nope, we do not get the new pixel 5 exclusive wallpapers with this build. And last but not the least, let us check for app opening animations. So there it is on your screen. No jitters, no lags, everything is pretty smooth. Let me open a few more applications. And as you can see, the animations are pretty good on this ROM. Here is the Google feed, no jitters, no lags. Now do note that I am using the G apt build of this ROM and it does not come with pixel launcher baked in. So if I go into settings, apps and notifications, default apps, the home application is fluid launcher, which does let you access your Google feed when you swipe left from the home screen you also have the swipe down gesture double tap gesture and other options as well and i do not think or i do not see the option for app hide so yes there it is you do not have the option for hidden applications as well as for the recents bam here it is this is how the recents look like now do note since we do not have the pixel launcher you only have the option of screenshot you do not have the option of select but as you can see the recents are pretty smooth and pretty fast we can also try switching between applications here it is that gesture works pretty great as well no jitters no lags with that respect either and there it is peeps that is what was new in fluid 1.2 rom based on android 11 running on the redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi mi 90 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you